Tanje, riding your keys or your voices or your catch and Yes, 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 yes. I don't need a mic this time. Okay, coach, uh, back so soon. <laughs> uh, did you even have um, not an opportunity to some corrections and just uh, plan properly for this one? Because they are coming in thick and fast. Uh, I think after our match against Mauritius, the following day, we just did recovery on the day of the match. And the following day, it was an off day. They just didn't train. I sent them to the beach. And the relief in their faces was like, Coach, you should have, I think you should have known all along you needed a break. You know, but um, it's about that. Uh, sometimes too much football, wanting to fix, 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 um, doesn't help the team. It only puts pressure and strain on them. So I think um, we just decided, let's give them an off day. We didn't watch any soccer. We just let them go to the beach and just relax and, you know, refresh and re you know, come back to themselves again and be excited about playing football again. And then we only trained once yesterday. And even yesterday, it was just for us to do some finishing touches. Um, and we were excited to, to, to see how we'll have those building blocks again uh, for this match because someone might look at it and say it's a, it's a dead, dead rubber. It'll never be a dead rubber because um, they win today, they're on seven points. We don't win today, we are on six points, we are out of the tournament, you know. So I think it's key for us to make sure that we come into this game level-headed and inspired to just go and, and grind and work hard as a team. Yeah, Coach, obviously this, this game you are probably playing, some might say, um, uh, a stronger opposition uh, alongside you in, 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 in this Group A. Um, you know, in terms of having looked at them, um, you know, the, the preparation against them, their approach and their formations, what have you made of them and, and how do you think you will fare? Look, um, absolutely, Mozambique is similar to us. Um, they play almost the same formation as us and they also have very technical players, especially in their midfield. They're able to piece uh, passes together and as soon as they're ready, they're able to find their front three who's very flexible, they can go wide, bring in the crosses, they can stay between the lines and be able to just go and go on attacks. Um, I think uh, their striker is also a lethal striker. She loves scoring goals. She's always positioning herself very central. So it will be key for us to make sure that um, we don't give them time and space on the ball. So when there's moments for us to kill the depth behind, we need to do that. When we need to give them space in front of us, that is a lot better because they have runners that can get behind uh, our defense. So it will be key for us to make sure that we make minimal mistakes, especially in our own half, because they're a team that can pounce on you and score goals against Mauritius in their first game. They scored a lot of great goals. They had a high press and we need to be wary of that because they know how to press you, set those traps, get the ball and then uh, uh, terminate those opportunities. And finally, coach, tell us a little bit about your lineup. Mm, our lineup today is a little bit uh, interesting. We made a mix of the team that played the first game and the, and the second game. As we go along, as we train, as we play, we get to understand and establish certain moments as to say how can we find other formations within the same formations where we don't find ourselves changing too much. So um, we are going with three at the back today. Um, and we, so we're going with a three, uh, one, four, two, because um, we just want to explore with that and see how can we have a variety in our formation. Because in this tournament, if you come the same way, teams will be able to plan for you and annihilate you as quickly and as much as they want to. So today we're going with three at the back because we just want to see what can we explore going forward for us. Thanks coach, good luck. Ooh.